guys, as you can see, in front of us there, the good guys at Former High Tech, they've got this brand new filter out. So uh, being a brand ambassador, I got the got the 100 mil holder before it's actually come out. So I think it's about two or three weeks before it's actually come out. So I thought I'd come down to the beach or to the shore and just give it a little bit of a try out and um, just see how we get on. Um, if we can just turn the camera now to the, just to the right. As you can see, the sun's gonna set over there, um, but nothing's gonna happen. So what I'm gonna do in a second, I don't think I'm gonna take any photos. I think I'm simply just gonna walk back to the car, I'll probably talk you through it there. I think it's absolutely bitter today. Um, but as you can see, first impressions. Well, this is the first time I've had it out. So as you can see, that's on the Z7 at the moment. That's a new 100 mil Firecrest 2 holder. Um, first impressions. Well, I've actually only had about had a play with it for about, I think about half an hour now. This is the first time it's been on the camera. Um, I love the lock at the moment. It's got a blue lock there, as you can see. That screws in nice and tight and that will not move. Um, and it'd be really good for astrophotography if you're doing night photography or like me, you like to go out when it's really wavy and the seas are bashing about everywhere. That is not gonna fall off. Um, I've kind of like shook it around um, but like I say I'm going to do a really in-depth review in about a week's time just gonna have a good play with it at the moment but they just sort of give you a first impressions um, I'll just turn to the side here and it looks decent it looks decent still got the guards on the front with, with there's no light leaks in um, yeah so all in all at the moment really good but as you can see at the moment my fingers are freezing it's absolutely Baltic down here at the moment um, so yeah I think I'll walk back to the car and try and give you a bit of a close-up and have a look at it that way hi guys as you can see I've actually drove home I've got in the car it's actually bolted today um, I think what I need to do is invest in some decent gloves because with a lot down and not being out as much as possible um, yeah my fingers are freezing so onto the holder itself, so here we are, we can have a close up and I think in a week's time or in a month's time when I've had this long enough to give you a proper review, this is just a first impressions. Um, on the back, this is what I'm really impressed with here, is that for me, uh, I'm not too sure, uh, I'm probably a clumsy photographer, I kind of like to get involved, so when we go to a seaside or we go to Blackpool for instance and the waves are crashing over, I want to know that this, as a bike goes past, I want to know that this won't fall off or we go to Lake District with climbing, um, so when we tied on, or at night time for instance with the light pollution filter when you put it in and you're walking about, you're not going to knock it off with your coat and just catch it, this will stay on, I've, done, I've had it now, I've tried to shake it, it will not come off. Uh, these guards, very much similar to the old ones, uh, you get the bottom one is a fixed one with no gap, which is really good, so the bottom one where you slide your filters in if you're doing um, like a 10 stop or a, a 16 stop and you want no light leaks you can put the solid one on the top and the solid one on the bottom so there's no gaps you've also got this one here which basically has got a gap piece is going to go past now that can at the bottom it just quick, quickly slides on very easily uh, no struggle to get these on this is what I really look there we go sticks on straight away I'm not going to edit this out because the car's going past because the helicopter will probably come past in a second uh, that's life I'm afraid so there's the guards and um, one of the and you can just watch this now on my finger quite easily just slide that filter in and out it's not uh, no problems whatsoever that goes straight in straight out and uh, I think on the back there you've got two little adjustment screws I've not touched this this is straight out of the box uh, but yeah first impressions this is really good and I look forward to using it and uh, on the side there, on the back, I don't know if I mentioned that, but that will be what your polarizer goes on. The polarizer comes with the kit. It also comes with about five or six different step rings uh, for your different size lenses. Uh, I think it's 72, 77, 82, and 86, I think, off the top of my head. And yeah, first impressions. After having an initial play with it, very impressed, very impressed indeed. So, <laughs> I'm gonna leave it there, get back in the house, get a nice brew and uh, watch some footy I think, back to normal. So take care and until next time, bye for now.